Welcome back, survivors. <laughs> Easy there, horsey. Disturb Z here. And we are checking out Outlaws of the Old West. Alright, guys. This is a brand new early access game. I literally got it like a couple days after its initial release. Or launch on Steam, whatever you want to call it. It is early access. It has its potential um i haven't really played it much i played it for like maybe an hour or two just to see if it can hold its own so far from what i can tell we've had updates on this game like every couple of days so the devs are very very active right now on the game and i think it's a hopeful game so let's go ahead and start us up a single player. Loading single player server, huh? Okay. Not exactly sure what that's all about, but all right. Sometime, eventually, maybe. Uh oh. Did we crash? Ah, no, we didn't. Come on. You can do it, game. I got faith in you. Oh, all right. We made it to the character selection screen. Uh, so yeah, that took a little bit longer than I wanted, but you know that's okay. Let's go ahead and put in our name. We don't really need a middle name or a last name. Let's see. Occupation. Carpenter, farmer, none. Um, I'm thinking we're going to go with none for the moment. Because I don't know if that does anything good for us or not. I haven't really got to play around. The last, the last and first time I ever played, I left it on none as well. Okay. So we could be a woman who has no hair. Or a dude with no hair. Yeah, we'll just be a dude. There's a hair option. Alright, what do we got here? That. How do I zoom in? Nope, oh, there we go. Can I rotate him? Mm. His eyes, though. They like stare into your soul and not like a good stare into your soul. You know, I guess that will work. Let's change up these eyeballs. Oh. Um. How many odd choices are there? 20 something? You know what? That will work right there. Let's get some facial hair. Uh oh. We got some funky facial hair. We gotta have the big old cowboy mustache. That's all there is to it. Let's see. Skin color, we're probably good there. Hair color. Um. I don't know, maybe, maybe that color, I guess, I'm sure. okay, let's go with some clothing, okay, okay, we're definitely going to have to go with the red undies, yep, 
we are rocking the red undies, guys. All right, well, let's start the game. We'll hop on in and see. Oh, wait, what's going on? Are we in the outhouse? Easy there. Oh, what in the world? Leave us alone, we're trying to play. Okay, maybe we weren't in the outhouse. Oh, there we go. Okay, I guess that was a coffin then. Alright. So, let's see, what do we got here? Can I pick? Ooh, we can pick stuff up. I got a stone. I got another stone. I heard... Is that a bird or a coyote? Um, no. No, no. No punching of stuff. Had to see if they changed anything. I know a lot of survival games like it to where you punch the tree, but not on this one. On this one, you pick up the stick or log or whatever you want to call it. Okay, we are finding a ton of logs here, or not logs, but rocks here it'd be nice to have some logs some nice little river down there okay can I make anything no I need more I need more wood okay gotta find wood guys here's some wood Oh, we just picked cactus with our bare hand. We're going to regret that tomorrow. We are most definitely going to regret that one. Alright, now we're finding a little bit of wood. Four pieces. Can I make anything? I can make that. Primitive axe. Okay, we got us a primitive axe. Let's throw that down there. Oh yeah. Now we're in business, guys. Now we are in business. Look at the majestic deer up there. You know, hang on one second here, guys. I'm going to adjust some of the volumes. Alright, guys. So I had to turn down the ambient sound. The, uh, the wind effect kind of kind of loud there. So anyway guys, let me know if any of the sounds need to be adjusted from y'all's angle. I don't know if like me hitting this tree is like super loud to y'all or if it's bearable. It feels like it's still a little bit loud. You know what? Let's just let's just go in the options and sound effects we'll just drop you down to like 80 I guess apply we'll just do that let me know if we need to drop it down a little bit more though guys let's see how loud this is yeah I think that's a little bit more bearable Alright, so as y'all can see, up in the top left corner, we do have meters. We have our health meter. Sorry, I'm looking down so we can see it better. Our health meter, our energy meter, our thirst meter, our hunger meter, our temperature meter, our morality meter, and our level. So, yeah, um... I'm not exactly sure how they're going to uh, 
dictate morality on this game. I guess, you know, we'll have our good actions and our bad actions. But yeah, it's interesting to see what is going to go on. And no, trees do not hurt you when they fall. Alright, so we got several pieces of wood. Let's go ahead and make up a pick. And I want a stone spear. A bola, a slingshot. I'm thinking a bow and an arrow would be nice. What do we need? Rope? Oh, we don't have no plant fiber. Oh, okay. Well, it is 6.55 p.m. So it is probably going to get dark here after a fall. We should probably find us plant fibers. There we go. I was just saying we needed to find some plant fiber. What about this stuff? Can I pick? Oh, I can pick you up. Some more cactus. Now you can eat the cactus fruit off of here. And that deer is glitched out. I wonder if we can run up here and hit it. Oh, we can hit it. Haha, you're going down, dear. Eat a loot. Some raw meat and some rawhide added. Alright, well, that's the first time I've ever seen a deer stuck on this game. Or any animal, for that matter. So, I don't know if that's a new thing. Or if we just got lucky and found one. Either way, we got us some food. Free meal. I'm not going to complain. Like I was saying a minute ago, you can eat the uh, cactus. And that little bit of time that I survived. I thought I heard a footstep. Uh, that I survived, you can get... You, I survived off of those, so... What do we got here? Hemp? We got the, the hemp plant, guys. So anyway, and in case if y'all are wondering why I keep looking around all randomly, sporadically, there are things in the game that will try to eat us. Um, there are wolves. Coyotes. The buffalo can get mad if we get too close to it. And there are outlaws in the game that will run up and shoot you. That is about the extent, oh yeah, and, and bears. There are bears, oh, and kitties. We, I thought I heard something. Um, there's mountain lions in the game, and I think pigs, but I can't remember if it's just a pig or if it's a boar. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. A little lag. So, and I'm sure there are more animals. I think we need to get... I want to get down this hill. Yeah, it's like nighttime. I want to get down here. By the river, I think. Okay, so we have our river. Have a rock right there. I don't think we can mine the rocks. Yeah, we can't mine the rocks. Alright, so... This is actually, like... <laughs> This is identical to where I came the uh, 
first time I played the game was right here in this spot. So I kind of know the area. So yeah, this might be a decent spot to kind of set up right now. Let's go ahead and go with the road. Build us a bow. I was about to say, do we not have enough for arrows? We'll make like 10 arrows. Let's make a campfire. And let's get a building camera. Alright. Bow will go on number 3. There is our arrows. Okay, got our campfire. Let's go ahead and place our campfire. I say we place it right here next to the wall. Let's go ahead and put our meat in there. And now I'm trying to remember, is there... Yeah, there's a way to split the stack. There we go. And ignite. And ta-da, we have a little fire. Which is probably good because our temperature was falling, so... Probably due to the rain. And our building camera. Alright, awesome. So now, I'm going to show you all how to do a little bit of building. There we go. I had to see something. The building hammer was kind of a little bit jacked up the other day. It didn't want to work when I scrolled to it. Alright, so we're going to start out with some log foundations. And... Oh... I don't know. We'll start building like right here. No! I didn't want my boards turned. Oh well. I'm not sure what dictates the uh, orientation of the boards here. So that is a 3x3. Three three. Do we want to go a little bigger? Uh, I think I want to go a little bit bigger. How do I get you to rotate? Right click? No. No. Hold up. Alright, give me a sec. I'm going to go look at the key controls. Alright, guys. I am back and I'm really not sure. Um, did we just run out of wood? Or is it stone? What is it that we need to make a foundation? Wood and stone. Okay, so we're going to have to do a little bit more uh, gathering here. There's our cooked food. I am going to, I guess, extinguish the fire. Okay, food is up. Water is up. Get out of here. Temp's kind of going down, but that's all right. All right. So, I'm going to go and gather some more uh, wood and stone, guys. And I'll bring y'all back here in just a second. All right, guys. It is morning. I ran into a cactus. I think we're almost where we need to be. Our dude is carrying a little bit of pause. Good thing about this game is weight is not a super big issue right now. Like, we're carrying, you know, 
like two and a half stacks of stone, almost two stacks of wood, and our dude's weight is literally at 16.7%. And there's a horsey right there. And yes, you can tame a horsey and ride the horsey. But we need a lasso, and we don't have access to that yet. So I want to leave him there, and hopefully... Because it looks like he got stuck on a rock. There might be a pathing issue here that wasn't there the other day. But we're going to leave him there, because you can spook the animals. We're going to leave him there. I'm going to grab this, uh, copper. No, it's iron. I'm going to grab it because we're getting stone out of it. And we need the stone in order to build. Otherwise, we're going to spend all day looking at the ground, picking up the little, the little bits. remember I know we need coal for something I don't know how soon we need coal but it might not hurt to collect a little bit of coal I think we need it for the forge maybe I don't know I didn't do all that. Like I said, I didn't go too far whenever I played. Um, speaking of which, here's our map. We're... I'm pro we were this way? I think we were this way. No, we were this way. Yeah, we were on the other side of that rock over there, I think. Alright, energy, go back up, please. What are you? It's a coyote. I wanted to say it's a little puppy dog, but no, it was a coyote. Yep, here we go. Here is our little base. Alright, so right now we got a 4x3. So... We need to add in just a few more foundations. I'm trying to see if I can figure out how to... There we go. No. Oh well. I'm not going to worry about the orientation of it. I know it's going to bother a little bit, but eh. It is what it is. Hey, give me some steps. Uh-oh. No, it's going to make me rotate. Oh, how do we ro- Oh, there we go. It's the scrolly button. Haha. -ha. You know, now I'm going to be upset because now our house is off. Yes, the screen. Okay, now I'm mad. Now I want to tear that out, but, you know, it'll be okay. Because I don't think you can get your, uh, I don't know if you get your resources back or not. Well, let's find out, shall we? No, it didn't give us anything back. So yeah, I could fix this, but yeah. All right, let's try to get a doorway. And let's do a wall here and a wall there. 
butterfly. I'm thinking that we'll do a window on each side. Oh yeah. So they have a real interesting um, building system here. I mean, it works fairly well. Fairly quick. I'm not going to say it's the world's best building system, but we were able to get this done pretty quick. Do that, and then... Yeah, let's do these little guys. Come on, why are you not... There you go. One there. You don't fit there. Okay. You don't fit there. But you fit there. And you'll fit there and there. Okay, so opposite corners. Gotcha. Ah, gotcha. Let's go with the ceiling. Um, sloped ceilings. game just put the ceiling up am I out of wood I'm out of wood no so anyway depending on how bad your OCD bugs you and this does kind of bug me a little bit and I do want to go fix that but that involves going and cutting more wood so give me a minute guys so that we can go cut some more wood and try to get our little cabin finished up and we'll be right back Alright guys, we are back. This coyote just tried to bite me. Ha! Down the coyote goes. For we are the new coyote hunter. Alright, so literally we didn't get much wood. I chopped down one tree. The coyote was behind the tree. I thought a lot of it stuck on a rock. I walked forward and it bit me. But that's okay because these bigger trees get more wood. So as long as you got a couple big trees, you're going to stack up the wood. We already got over 200. Just off of those couple. We still got stone. I say I grab a couple more trees and then we'll make it back to the house. But I did want to show you the little coyote and all that stuff. Alright guys, we are back. I have got a roof on. Um, I was going to try to fix this since it only took logs, but I can't access it. Oh, that's cool. The little sun rays were coming into the crack right there. That's awesome. But yeah, I can't reach it to dismantle it. So yeah, there you go. And I was going to build a door, but our log door requires planks. Which, I'm not even going to argue on that one. The, uh, the thought process of, you know, why would a log door require planks? Wouldn't a plank door require planks? But, you know, that is what it is. And since we got another moment, I want to take a look at some of the stuff that we can kind of make real fast. Uh, trowels... Where's our building stuff? What is this? Carry crate. A simple crate to store items. Or a storage box. We need ropes and planks. Stone forge. 50 stone. Stone fireplace. Large campfire. Anvil. Need iron ore. 
used to make horseshoes and glass molds. Table saw. Mega campfire. Uh oh. Mega campfire, guys. And a carpentry bench. So. Yeah, we got like a lot of options to build and all that kind of good stuff here, guys. But anyway, I think we're going to save that for the next episode. So let me know what y'all guys think of the game so far. I think it's a well-designed game. I mean, yeah, it's early access. It has a couple bugs and glitches. But, I mean, just look at it. Does it not just look pretty? I mean, I really do think this is a pretty-looking game. So anyway, guys, that's going to do it for today's episode. I do hope everybody has enjoyed it. If you have, be sure to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. It is an awesome, awesome, awesome way for you to show your support to me, to the channel, to the video, and to the game itself, guys. And as always, feel free to share the video on any social media you're using. And guys, just like to stop, take a moment to thank each and every one of y'all for all of your wonderful, awesome support. All the comments, all the likes, all the subscribers, and all the videos shared, guys. It is awesome. I do appreciate it. And with that being said, uh, until next time, survivors, keep on surviving.